As an educator of color, I know how much that identity and I think the alignment between who you are and what you see matters. That's another reason why I really make sure that we're having some kind of lens where we can speak about why, who we are, and, and how we navigate the world is valid. All right, so it's 11.05, we are gonna get started. And welcome to our last Literature Circle and Socratic Seminar discussion. Mr. Nagayoshi, he pushes people to always strive for their best self. And he puts on this pressure on you, but that's because he knows how great you can be. Being the Nagayoshi's son of two immigrants and he's also a gay teacher, he has this very roundabout perspective of, about the world. To have a leader like that and a role model like that as a teacher, I think is phenomenal. And what you're gonna do once you are together with your partner, I'm gonna ask you guys to share your PrEP 3 document. I think that the rain could have represented... So a lot of the work that I do has been based around activities that are inherently peer and group oriented. He really wants everyone to kind of form their own opinion and also to be able to listen to other people's opinions even if you might not agree with them. The development and the thinking and the metacognition of our students come from, yes, the content, but also those conversations that we have, the learning that we do through each other. And what Takeru has been able to do is really highlight the actual success and the brilliance of the children of New Bedford. The vast, vast majority of you have been doing such a wonderful job, keeping up with expectations, keeping up with communication. His drive to make sure that his students are doing good, and not just his class, but other classes too, that really pushed me towards making sure that I was on top of my stuff in sophomore year and freshman year. We have increased our graduation rates. Our test scores have risen up. A couple of years ago, we led the state in the number of AP capstone certificates that were awarded to students. He does everything he needs to do to make sure that in the end, we're accomplishing and exceeding past whatever expectation it is. TK also understands that it's his obligation to fight for full funding of public education, a fight where we won $1.5 billion. Imagine a world where our best and brightest, our most socially conscious, are going into the classroom and are inspiring the next generation of folks. That's the kind of country that I want. And I think it starts from teachers who feel that way to also put that message out there. <laughs>